already due to popular demand um, we are going to learn about new boxes uh, new file dialog which I'm going to start from scratch I was just looking at my old one to see how I did it um, it's pretty simple so what we're going to do is we're going to open our projects tutorial for this is just a continuation of our tutorials we're not going to implement the GL window that's just going to be there for all of you guys who want to implement it right now is what we're going to do is we're going to go file new file or project and we're going to go uh, QT and um, let me think I think it's QT designer form class Q yep, QT designer form class and now it's going to bring us up with this and we're going to go uh, it depends on what you want I'm going to do dialogue with the two buttons in the bottom and the reason I am going to do that is because we are going to have a little thing that allows us to click OK and stuff and as you know I have OCD with this has to be capital otherwise I can't read it must be dyslexic I don't know but uh, then we add it and it'll come up with our new form like this and we come and we're like okay what do we want to add within this and uh, the things I'm going to add is I'm just going to add where is it because we're going to want to be able to open a file or what are we going to want to do uh, yeah we're going to create a spin box here and another spin where the heck did spin box go and another spin box here and a line edit here and this is going to be kind of how you would set up a map editor and then what you do is you would go just uh, label and pull here and you'd go uh, map width and then you just extend this to be uh, the right size and you do the same thing for map height and we're not going to implement the tile sheet uh, we're going is what I'd do is I'd have two boxes here one for a tile sheet and one for the uh, map name but right now we're just going to do map name because we're not really going to implement this I'm just showing you how to create a new dialog box and hopefully map name map, yeah map name should fit there map name and then so now we've got all our stuff set up so now we go to edit and we have our dialog.h and actually I kind of wanted this to be called new dialog but that's cool uh, don't worry about it and I'm gonna have basically a pr private slot a public slot I think public slots uh, and I'm gonna make a struct up here just because I want to contain the info struct map info and sorry this isn't this is kind of going off track of what I'm supposed to be doing but what I want to do is int w h and then I want to have oops I forgot my semicolon and I want to have a I'll just use a char because I don't want to include anything char name and then I want to for my slots uh, uh, shoot. I want to somehow set the map equal to this. So basically, I'm not going to go over all this stuff right now because we're just going to go over the uh, on. So on OK. We're going to make a void on OK. Actually, I'm sorry. We're going to do this the easy way. We're going to forget about this whole map crap. We're just going to show you about dialogues today. Because I'm getting off track. Basically, we're going to right click this. 
go to slot accepted so on button box accepted we're gonna um, do nothing I mean shoot so when it's accepted so if you had like a map or something in here you would just give you pass a pointer to the map and then just do map dot set all this crap up and then you do the same thing I'm getting kind of off track but uh, then you would go to slot and you would go to on rejected so that's, this is if it clicks cancel and then you do that for on rejected as well and the thing you would do is you would pass a pointer to your map or whatever and use the thing I don't know if you could return it in a slot like return a value so what you could do is you could have uh, I'll do this for you guys because I a little like helping. It's gonna be annoying. I'm just gonna have int width height and because I don't want to include anything, char name. Uh, otherwise, I probably would just use it as a um, string or something, Q string. But uh, so on box accepted. We're gonna set width equal to UI dot uh, what is it? It's spin box. The width is the first spin box dot value. So that and you can rename these in the form. I'll do that in a second. I'll show you how to do it. And then the height will be the spin box two value. And then the name will equal, the, I think it's the line edit, UI line edit dot text. There we go. That's how we do it. And on rejected, we'll just set these equal to zero. And We'll just do that for uh, if they reject it. And then you could make accessors and stuff, but that's just basically, I'm just trying to show you, and then if you want to change the names and stuff, uh, so you click the spin box one, and you come over here, and you see how it's uh, spin box right here, and you change the name by going uh, map width. But I'm going to undo that, because I don't want to have to redo this stuff. So. I'm gonna pause it, build it, and show you what happens. Okay, I got an error. Unfortunately, I did not follow my plan. Oh, right, actually, I'm gonna do this the real, the real way. Usually, I wouldn't do a name. I would do M name for member, and I didn't do that. I am sorry. Time to compile. Uh, yet again, stupid mistake. Do two std string dot c underscore string because you can't convert a char to a, a q string. Okay, I do not know why C++ invented the freaking constant keyword. We're not going to set the name equal right now. It's easier to do it if you do it using a Q string. Uh, but actually, you know what? I'm going to use a freaking Q string. Screw it. I'm sorry. But the constant keyword pisses me off more than anything. Const freaking can't do this, can't do that because it's a constant. Blah dee -dee blah. Q string name. Constants suck. I'll let you watch the build this time. Da, 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 da. Maybe I shouldn't have let you watch the build. I'll pause it real quick. Sweet. Okay. Now our thing ran and I forgot to tell you. We have to implement this. Main window.h. Real quickly. Include dialog.h. It should be new dialog, but I forgot to rename it. And then just do a uh, private, and we're gonna name it dialog m m dialog. And I guess I'm gonna create a pointer to it. No, you know what? You don't need to. You don't need to. And 
and connect, we're going to connect this. UI. Uh, actually, I'm going to create the slot first because it makes my life easier. Void new. And then we're going to go here and we're going to connect the UI dot action new. What's that? Menu new? That, that's not what it should be, is it? It should be dot action. We don't have an action new. I have to change that. File. We have an action new right here. Freaking crazy. Does it say? Action new. I guess we don't have an action new. I don't know why. I can't figure out why it's not new. We'll type another new one down there, I'm sorry. <sighs> I can't understand. Okay, we got a different action new now. The first new didn't work. It may have for you. Okay, we're gonna do trigger it again. This and slot new. So, and then we just gotta quickly create this void window new, and basically we're gonna do m dot execute. So we're gonna create the dialog, we're gonna execute the dialog, and that's about it. Let's check it out. Alright, let's hope this works. It'll be this new because the other new didn't work. And as you see, it pops up, and you can be like, I want my map height to be 7, and I want my or map width to be 7, I want my map height to be I want my map may be uh, death map. Death map. Okay, and everything's cool. And the same thing, I mean, nothing happens right now, but see, it'll open up again, and just everything will be saved the same as it was before, unless you reset it and then you can cancel and it'll be cool and then what will happen oh dang it so if you were to grab the values the values would be there still so you could grab them and that's the new file dialog so our cute programs kinda coming together you know basically just remember actions are those little file things and you can connect them I don't know why the first one didn't connect it should be action lowercase new but for some reason it's not. Actually, I'm going to try something. There was something. Uh, where's this other new? I saw a new before. Menu new. What is menu new? I'm going to try it. I'll pause it for you. Figured it out, I think. This is because the new had one of those out tabs, and I think I have the actions, and I'll get the action the zeroth. But... Yeah, I think I'm close to out of time, so I'll show you that later. Alright. Peace.